come install a Rocket Bunny styled spoiler on my 350Z. I decided that I really wanted a bolt on duckbill, even though everyone and their moms told me not to. But since I'm stubborn and like to learn firsthand, I decided to do it anyways. I started with wrapping the spoiler in four pieces because I simply don't trust my wrapping skills enough to have it done in one. I started placing masking tape on the rear end and then lined up the spoiler to where I thought it would sit and marked where I had to drill the holes. Looking back at it now, I could have made my life easier and formed the ends of the spoiler to the trunk before wrapping it since it has a slight gap at the ends of the spoiler, preventing it from sitting properly. I started with drilling smaller holes and ended using a 3 8 It's my first time using rivets and while they're fun to install in the moment, they totally did me dirty. I had to dremel out the holes in the spoiler, but the final look came out pretty good. The duckbill goes with the car perfectly. But if you ask me if I would do it again, well, the answer is I learned my lesson. Stay tuned for the rest of the series.